generation of stars in women's boxing just eight and 14 years old the two local kids you're about to meet are already making names for themselves in the sport jessica formoso has more on their impressive talent big dreams and how they're hoping to encourage more young girls to step into the ring how does it feel good she may be little but she's fearless Ruby Tucker is a boxer. She has impressive technique and strength for her age. I study boxing a lot with my dad, and I mainly watch fighters that, that do my style, like Julia Spalo, people that are like, that have this style like me. The eight-year-old started boxing at the age of three when she didn't even know what boxing was. Did you know anything about boxing at three years old? No, but surprisingly, I knew how to throw a jab at three years old. We didn't begin this as a boxing journey. I just started out as a dad looking to train his daughter in a little bit of self-defense, you know. Um, I just wanted her to be able to be able to defend herself. Her father is her coach. She inspired him to open up a boxing gym in Elizabeth, New Jersey. It's been years of me instilling discipline and work ethic, and that's what you see now from her. Ruby wasn't eligible to compete until she turned eight. Just this month, she competed at the Silver Gloves Tournament in Missouri, where she won one, but came in second place overall in the 60 pounds Pee Wee age eight division. She now heads to the nationals in April. I'm definitely going to be winning that, and I'm gonna, and from now on, I'm going to be knocking people down all the time. She is witty, smart, and determined. A small girl with big dreams and a big heart. I have a lot of goals. If I box, I can earn money from that, and I could give the money to poor people for them to be successful in life, like me. Good job. Ruth. Over in Brooklyn, we found this other father-daughter duo. Meet Layla Zakharova of Staten Island. Her love for boxing runs in her blood. Her father, who is her coach, is a boxer himself and has over 30 years of experience. He just wanted me to try it at first just for self-defense, and then it just kind of became a, like I had a love for it, and it just kind of became like competition through competition through competition. The 14-year-old started throwing punches at the age of five. I saw she have a talent, the natural speed, and I, I, I say, Layla, let's go try, uh, try competing. She said, okay. So at the age of 10, she did her first competition. It was the Nationals, and she won. I was just bursting out of joy. I started like happy crying and stuff. Hard work pays off. Whenever she has a competition, she trains seven days a week, twice a day. She's a seven-time national champion and with other titles under her belt. They gave me this as an outstanding female boxer. She, too, has impressive technique and is focused. She hopes to go to the Olympics one day and bring back the gold. Everything is possible if you put the love in your heart and you have the love for boxing, go out and do it. And in April, Layla's heading to Ohio for the Nationals, hoping to bring her eighth title back home. We wish her the best of luck. In Brooklyn, I'm Jessica Formoso, Fox 5 News.